This is Kakukong K1, a loosely King Kong inspired OC, Kagane, and Kakuja. And he's gonna cost you a good 500 million yen to buy. And the playstyle is a mixture of Yamo K1 and Edo K3. And if you do find this showcase helpful or enjoyable, make sure to leave a like and subscribe. And without further ado, let's get into it. This Kakuja requires you to be at least level 1000 and to have over 20 million RC. It also comes with three different passives. Kokaku Kakuja Defense, giving you 20% damage reduction, along with Long Stride, two times walk speed, and no dashes. And finally, Power Leap. Jump now propels you forward greatly, while also being vertically aimable. This is essentially the same as Edo K3's jump mechanic, however, it has a much higher cooldown when aimed vertically. Attack, a simple but powerful jab punch. If the target is dazed, stun them. The attack has a zero second cooldown, however, if the target is dazed, it is dropped to zero seconds. This move deals 0.75 damage. If the target is dazed, it deals 0.5 seconds of slight knockback. Spec 1, strike while advancing with the momentum of a hook punch. This move has a 2 second cooldown, however if the target is hit, it is 4 seconds. It also deals 1.2 damage and applies 0.5 seconds of knockback. Spec 2. Attack with a flying knee, knocking targets hit up and back, applying daze to them. This move has a 3 second cooldown, however it will be raised to 7.5 seconds if a target is hit. This move deals 1.5 damage, applies 1 second of knockup slash knockback, and also applies 1 second of daze. Spec 3, shoot forwards like a wrestler, reaching out to grab a target, with different interactions depending on you if you miss, grab, or just collide with your target. If you miss, you will follow up with a shoulder charge that dazes. If you grab the target, you will pick them up and smash them onto the ground, dazing them. If you collide with your target, whether they have anti-grab or are too large to grab, you will stun them in the initial collision, then shoulder charge which applies daze. This move initially has a 4.5 second cooldown, however if you landed on a target it will be 10 seconds. This move deals 0.8 damage on the initial shoot, 1 second of stun or grab if applicable. The grab and slam deals 1.2 damage, applies 1 second of stun, and applies 2 seconds of daze. The shoulder charge is exactly the same except replace the 1 second of stun with 1 second of knockback. Special bonus, pound your chest and roar, giving yourself 100% damage reduction after the first chest pound. The indicator for the damage reduction is when you have the golden glow around Kong. This move has an 8 second cooldown, however, if you are cancelled and the move doesn't activate in time, it will only be 3 seconds. Block, an enhanced block that turns the passive 20% damage reduction into 67% damage reduction. Now I'll hop in a public server to give you guys a good idea of what it looks like used in PvP. Come on bro. Come on. Come on. Where are you going, bro? Oh, don't tell me he's gonna run. Okay, he's lagging. He's lagging. He can't run. I'll beat you up, though, man. Come here. Grab doesn't quite work on me. I'm pretty sure Kong hard counters Yama. I'm pretty sure, I mean, I don't know. Okay, if you want to fight now, go ahead. But if you run again, I'm gonna hop on Yama and wall up you. I'm just mashing my keyboard. Watch this. W fight? He couldn't even run? The stuns. Bro, so freaking true. Oh, okay, he made it. Yeah, man. It's definitely a bit of a struggle trying to get over to him. Well, especially if he's frickin' running, man. Screw you. I'm not fighting you if you're doing that. Oh, I, I swear I jumped. That was on cooldown. Come 
one. We're nearly there. Or he's getting me with those unblocked hits. It's crazy. Or get back here. Oh, he, he fumbled the bag, bro. Oh my gosh. There we go. I don't particularly... You're using an ape. What do you mean by that? Come on, bro. Come on, bro. He knows the method. He does not know the method. He does not know the method. Thanks for the back in, little monkey man. Hello. Yo, I got, I got multiple of them on me. I've got the, I've got the regular Edo K1 and the acoustic Edo K1 on me, bro. This ain't not good. This ain't not good, yo. Hold on, hold on. Hold on, hold on. Yo, the, the Jerry, what? Why did this turn into a 3v1? Mate. W aim? I'm lagging, I'm lagging. like anything with a Kakuji hitbox, or a bigger hitbox than normal. Is this Hinami on me as well? Brother. Ah, it hits me midair! That's not fair. That's supposed to be <laughs> my way to evade all of the damage. Come on, bro. I couldn't even hit him, I was too high up. Bro, you're so glassy. Come on. Bro, I, it looks like I'm right on top of him, it's weird. There we go. Let's hit a K1 again. Ow. Bro. He called in the holy dinosaur guardian from the clouds. What the frick? He's so glassy as well. Oh my god. Sometimes the M1s aren't as fast as other times. I wonder if that is <laughs> That was horribly missed on. Yo, bro, I wonder who won that fight. You're gonna have to stay tuned for when I do Kakajira versus Kong. And if you enjoyed this video, leave a like, subscribe, all that, and peace.